Welcome to the final match of the Academy Showcase. It's 2-2. Two, two. So, uh, uh, Sneak Attack Kid won over JPH Nake on our team. I won over Sneak Attack Kid. Splashing Black defeated me. Chris defeated Splashing Black. So now it's Chris versus Avery61. Drink break is still going on. We don't know what he's playing. But he knows what Chris is playing, so that's a disadvantage. Has it already started? Mm, yeah, it has! My god! I'm not paying attention. There's the first turn, Delmo! <laughs> Go, Delmo! Bad hand, I don't want to hear that. Oh, we took a mulligan too. Oh, it's Boris Kitty! But that's a horrible start! Snap would be really awesome here! Wow, it's an early Glimpok attack! <laughs> Mono White Del. <laughs> yeah, Delver has problems with two two flyers. But Chris is not gonna try to play the beat down here. I don't know if he has played this matchup. Did Chris miss his land drop? Yeah, he did. Oh my god. That could get ugly. But it's not like Avery is coming out of the gate firing either. He's set back by his glint hook so badly. But Chris does nothing. Chris has said in team chat that he's not winning this, he's already so far behind, but here is a quicksand! The Cloud of Fairies! Nice! He snaps the glint hawk! My experience of this matchup, which is very limited, is that uh, Boris Kitty is favored. But uh, Chris would probably say something else. Oh, nice! But there could be a bolt. There could be a bolt. Or Galvanic Blast. There is. And Sky Fisher comes through. How fitting if Boris Kitty would win this! Because Boris Kitty is playing the final match, uh, the final round of the Popper Gauntlet on Thursday. And it's Boris Kitty versus. Wow, Ninja! Nice! Boris Kitty versus Illusion Tricks. Uh, out of 47 decks, those are the two decks that remain, and Illusion Tricks is not that different from Delver. So this is something like the two remaining decks in the Popper Gauntlet. But now let's talk about this instead. Ninja is running amok and could help Chris recover, but he still can't find the land. And Boris Kitty is grinding away. And here comes Skyfisher to stop the Ninja. Place Glim Talk instead, could that mean that he actually has the burn spell as well? I think it does. I think Ninja is going to die. Yes, he does. 
Uh, random fact, my hand has been poised at F2, waiting to OK something. Uh, that's like, I played too much magic. There's Cloud of Fairies. Hmm, why is he playing the Cloud of Fairies now? Because he wants the spell stutter stuff. That's why. Like the Skyfisher. Can he recover here? If anyone can do it, it's Chris. Oh god, Avery has eight cards in hand. That's a lot. That's a lot of cards. So the wellsprings are not doing a ton here. Here's Rebirth, that's a fantastic target for a spell status sprite. A crit doesn't have it. <sighs> we want to win this first Academy Showcase. Want to win it for Team Love, or maybe Team MTG of Strat, or Team CPC, or Team uh, Crazy Brewers, or, uh, well, I don't know what we are calling ourselves. Delver is going to die. There's a brainstorm happening, where are we at? What face? This is so complicated. I think this is now an open match. <laughs> Those goblin tokens look hilar hilarious and they sure do. And here's an India! He wanted to keep quicksand open. Ninja could recover here. Find the land! Someone modded a troll doll, yeah. Oh gosh! There's a lot of stuff happening now. Cloud of Fairies! Oh, that's why he wanted to tap two islands. I think Chris has recovered, but... Ah, well, he isn't in that bad shape, is he? Oh, of course he's taking five damage here. And we are quite far away from uh, the Spy Golem. Spell Stat Sprite comes here, but will it have any chance? Looks like Chris is losing this. Need to get on Twitter. Stuff is happening on Twitter. And I should start uploading as well. Well, now I have to figure out where the hell the the files are. Snag it map? No. Oh, found them. I think this is 
over Okay, we are one, 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 one duel from losing this, and we're going. All right, Delvis bolted. Okay, now I have uh, I check Twitter here. And I should get my commenting energy going again. Spell for the sprite! Will it work? Electricity would suck. Get it! Go, Chris! Is he streaming this? Nice. I'm distracted. Ninja of the Deep Hours! Really distracted. Yeah, he is streaming it. Sweet. Ninja dies, but that's what he, ninjas do. 22 watchers. We were unable to connect to chat. Wow, look at this. Nice stuff. Let's follow him. I wasn't logged in. Okay, let's focus on this instead. Well, four cards against six. I think Boris Kitty is a hard matchup for Delver. <laughs> Given all the grindiness and all the removal, and Delver traditionally has a hard time with decks with a lot of cheap removal. There is Mr. Delver himself. Wow, my upload is going really slowly. Journey to nowhere. Well, that's a one for one. I think that's exactly what Chris can take at this point, as he's so far ahead. This could be a win for the Delver deck. I think Chris would love a race here. Uh, uh, uh. Another ninja. Mm. 
Nice. I think Chris could easily win this. And now spell started too. Pretty good. If you want to see more team battles, follow Justin here on Twitter. So he will be organizing a lot of them. Or check out his articles on MTG Academy. I will try to include the link in the show notes to this video. Because this is fun stuff. There will be a league for teams. Uh, I can't join that, but I hope somebody is from... I hope David is. Or this part of my team, because I'm going away on a romantic weekend with my wife in the middle of the league. A romantic week, rather. But I had the opportunity to play here. Spell status sprite! It's the king! But maybe this is the time where he has electricery. He has a bolt, but yeah, that helps. But Chris still has five cards in his hand, and that should be more than enough to get to the last, the very last duel. The first video isn't even up yet. Course Sky Fisher stops the entire team. Oh, nice one! But it's empty, isn't it? It is empty, and it also counts. It's also counterspelled. But still, the blue team is not able to attack. Brainstorm. Hopefully find something useful. Skyfisher is really dominating here. But one for one in with Delver seems pretty sweet. And it takes it. And that will bring the game to deadlock. Yep. Stalemate it is. He only has lands in his hand then, probably. Uh, or counter spells. And or counter spells. Spell status sprite. Very nice. Still the skyfish is stopping everything. Faithless looting. Yeah, that's probably something that should be allowed to resolve. Well, 
Very locked. Hydro exclude brainstorm deprive island. Ooh, okay. Well, uh, that's what not was not only lands. So Chris is now extremely well positioned to do good things, like excluding that guy. So fat attack, and we are probably off to game number three, the deciding duel. And maybe, just maybe, if I had kept that Crypt Mana open, this would not have been needed. But, of course, this is more exciting, isn't it? I really hope there is sound on my videos, by the way. If I haven't checked that in this new setup, I think there is. Well, he's going to be excluded, though there might be a Pyroblast for that. But we know what he has. He has to deprive as well, so... NICE! Go Chris Weaver! Game equals mine. Rebirth. Hydroblast. <laughs> Oh, that's naughty! Well, now I'm tweeting that it's down to the final duel, but uh, it's not over yet. But it is pretty damn close to over. Yeah, looks stable. All lamps in hand. Can he? Well. Electric would just wipe out Chris's team. But I don't know if even if it's even in the deck. Delver flips for the game. <laughs> nice! <laughs> Grappling Prang didn't think it was in time, so he, d he ran away. Oh, 
Whew. <laughs> really cool event. Thank you, Justin. I think Chris is going to be the hero of the day if he can make it. Okay. Chris says arg. That's probably not good. Uh, this is not it, is it? Where's the game? There it is. Okay. <laughs> Chrissy. Chris. Not the most tempoish play. Chris has a land, so why is he scared? Why is there arg? I don't know! God! Chris, win this! Show us that Boris kid is a rogue bro! Mr. Glintalk! Spell stutter, but there is a bolt coming! There is a lightning bolt, there is an open red mana! It's a pyroblast this time! And Glintalk is on the table! Okay, focus. So, what will happen? There is an exclude. I, I, I'm, <laughs> I think there is an exclude. Definitely an exclude coming. But there is a prism coming, and not a creature. Which would be quite bad for Chris. But spell, spell starts sprite and there is another bolt, maybe. Is there a bolt? If there is no bolt, this will be sweet. Especially if there is a ninja. But that red mana looks like a bolt mana and there is a galvanic blast! And Prism hits. We can still get a ninja hit out of this. Which should be crucial. Go Ninja! Ninja! Come on Ninja! Yes! Ninja of the Deep Hours! There is no telling how anything will end here now. Could go any way, either way. This is the last duel. Skyfisher. Spell stuttering the Skyfisher would be really good, but there are... There is another spell stuttering Will this one hit? Yes! That was probably very crucial. Three Spire Golem. Oh, another one! God damn it! Another spell stutter coming. What about the Skyfisher? A 
there was another spell status part. No, it's a deprive. That delays the spy golems. Core Skyfisher just puts a stop to everything. Is he running away with this? So how will he get through triple spy golem? That will be so hard for him to get through. So this match will probably be really, really long. And Boris Kid is grinding him down. But that's interesting. There's the nin the spy golem mana. Double spy golem. This match will go on forever. Except for your need to nowhere. And Galvanic Blasts. Echoing Ruin. Yeah, that would be cool. You need to know her. Angling talk. That the fort is being held. So he will eventually grind through this. What a weird board state. <laughs> Who needs squadron hawk when you can have glint hawks? Well, how are you going to get through this, Chris Weaver? All about the multiples, yeah. We have seen a lot of multiples tonight. But no, there's another journey to nowhere! But it's getting counterspelled! Would be epic if Boris Kiddy lost to Mill, but I doubt that will happen. He says he's not winning this game. He has to survive three more Galvanic Blasts and three Yearnest Nowhere. But of course, Haver can just burn him out, right? Eventually. The first video is up.
I'm getting distracted by stuff going on. This looks really hard. Really, really hard. Miscounted, what did he do? What's happening? Maybe I should play, pay attention instead of uh, tweeting and uh, stuff. Sanctum Gargoyle. Oh, no counter spells. So much value. All right, so what's happening here? Lots and lots of damage. Going to six. I don't know. Spy Golem can't hold it down forever. Another blocker. Delver. Looks pretty hard. He can block and kill the glint hawk. We have not got this. We are going to lose. And three nasty cards in Avery's hand. Could just be bolt bolt here. Oblivion Ring. Is that game? Oblivion Ring for Spy Golem. Oh, that's GG's. <laughs> Poor performance where two four flying is like genitus. Uh, thank you for watching. We did lose this. And congrats to Avery61, Sneak Attack Kid, and Splashing Black, who brought it down.